Here we go. I got three. One, two, three. Go. From the speakers of a JV baseball game. For the Lobos, number 11. In Little L. Was brought to you by. A silky voice echoes throughout the stadium. All foul balls of the first inning. Are... And you know, it sounds like someone who knows what they're doing. Someone who's been doing this for years. Top half of the first inning. It can't be some baby face kid with a mullet, bottle cap glasses, unable to grow facial hair. I would love facial hair, actually, but. First baseman. Number 41. You know, a mustache is my goal, but I can't I can't grow one, and it makes me really mad. The third baseman, number 33. It <laughs> turns out 17-year-old Pierce Listener has us all fooled. And they say, man, I thought you were a 40-year-old man that had a pack of cigarettes for breakfast. <laughs> Listener used to play on this field, but sophomore year it became clear he wasn't anything special on the diamond. They needed somebody to announce the JV game, and I raised my hand, and I said, yeah, I'll, I guess I'll do it. The left fielder, number 49. So he went from the bench to the booth. And I came back down, and coaches were like, man, you're you're really good at that. Waiting on for the Lobos. This Listener suddenly fell in love being a sports PA announcer. I was like, this is what I want to do. Number 41. The senior started doing JV, varsity games, football, even basketball. He also met Rangers PA announcer Chuck Morgan. But sometimes when I am announcing batters or the lineups, it does come out as a little Chuck. Fans, please be aware of the no student. Owning his craft, now a focus for college. So keep an ear out. Yeah, I just want to throw my voice out there. And if you see something, say something. You might hear this voice again. Thanks for coming to a Lobo. In Little Elm, I'm Matt Howerton. Oh, my goodness. Pierce, don't worry about it. My husband is a little bit older than you, and, well, he can't grow facial hair either.